It's officially announced, it's been seven years since the release of the Inspire 2, and DJI have officially dropped the mic on the Inspire 3, and these are the top five things that we think make this drone a beast. At number five, RTK compatibility. The creatives are finally unlocking the power of RTK that was previously only found in the Enterprise drones, giving this drone centimeter level accuracy that not only makes flying more stable, but also makes flight route planning more accurate, significantly improving creative efficiency. At number four, Waypoint Pro. This new smart feature is specifically designed for aerial cinematography. With the new repeatable routes and 3D dolly modes, it's like having your drone on rails in the air, so even if you're solo shooting, it makes it easier to master highly complex scenes. At number three, the DJI RC Plus controller. Now previously found in the Enterprise M30, the DJI Pilot 2 app for Inspire has had a huge upgrade, adding a cinema grade monitoring interface, which allows simple checking of information like camera exposure, video specifications, focal length, and gimbal angles. It's ergonomic, has a huge 7 inch 1200 nit high bright screen with a smooth 1080 60 hertz refresh rate. It has fully customizable buttons and as standard comes with accessories such as a strap and waist support for more comfortable and efficient long duration use. At number two, dual native ISO. Light is everything in cinema, and it can't be understated how the dual native ISO at 800 and 4000 unlocks the capabilities of capturing spectacular scenes at dawn, dusk, and night shooting. Finally, at number one, the thing we're looking forward to the most is the camera system. The X9 camera has an 8K full frame sensor with ProRes and Cinema DNG licenses available to unlock for a price, and is what elevates this drone to compete with the heavy lift drone capabilities that lift REDS and ARRI cameras on major film productions. What's more, it can shoot 4K 120 frames without any cropping. That's just five of the things that we're most excited about in this savage looking drone. There'll be plenty more Inspire 3 videos coming your way as soon as it lands in Australia, and we can take it on some real world operations and really test it to its limits. So make sure you subscribe so you don't miss out, and I'll see you in the next one.